All right, for those who know me, um, I'm not a very religious person, but I'm standing here uh, besides the monument and the dedication to the Virgen de Guadalupe. Uh, this is actually fairly new. A lot of uh, the church for a long time did not recognize this saint uh, as part of the church. Uh, from those of you who know the indigenous history, uh, the Virgen de Guadalupe is also uh, said to be a symbol that was created to replace Don Ancin, which was the ancient um, uh, indigenous uh, uh, woman who the indigenous people worshipped as a goddess, Don Ancin. Um, and on top of uh, Don Ancin, where uh, that would have been um, in existence today, sits where the, the church where the Angel, the, the Angel of Juan, the Saint San Juan uh, saw the Virgin Mary, or Virgen de Guadalupe. Um, but again, for those who know the history, uh, religion has been used to divide people, to control people. Uh, religion has been used to oppress people. Uh, but it, it's interesting historically that this was never in here. This is the first time that you'll see uh, the Virgen de Guadalupe in this cathedral that's 900 years old. So it goes to show how society will develop and come around and even if you're not part of that religion, uh, you can see the value in, in discrimination uh, in, in, uh, in racism uh, because the church was that. It was, it was racist, very racist, uh, very discriminatory. And it's only recently that this was allowed to uh, be admitted into this church.